How's it going, me family? See me here with another review. Today we're gonna review the, the Surf Vanguard Sabertooth Walker. The sets are getting bigger and bigger, and it's it's kind of cool, you know. I get to build some more sets. It takes me a lot more time to build them, and yeah. So let's get this started. Here's Gorzan, I think. Yes, he's all red now because he bled. And that's it. That's basically it. I mean, design-wise, uh, he's like, they all have the same clothes, so nothing changes, I guess. Uh, so, uh, yeah, yeah. The, the, the minifigs are decent, gotta say. They're very detailed, but there's not much difference between uh, the, the main team of characters, uh, a.k.a. Gorzan, Eris, uh, Laval, and all those guys. They all have the same suit, and also, red doesn't fit Gorzan well. Look at that, it's just such a, such a big, it's such a big contrast, it doesn't really work well. Uh, also, his weapon, so huge, so huge. Like, again, look, look at that, look at that. Who the crap is going to wield a weapon that is legitimately that tall? No one. Makes no sense. So Gorzan, get the heck out of here. Next up is Stealthor. He just looks like some kind of person that just straight out came, came you know, that just came out of Call of Duty or something. He looks like a COD player. Look at that. Super big gun thing with, it's just awkward. I don't know. The gun just doesn't make much sense. But, gotta see though, it's cool. Uh, when I saw this piece in the box, I was like, ooh, a new piece, I'm always excited to see what they're for. And, nope, just for this. Of course, there was another one in the set that made a bit more sense, but uh, it, it was just awkward, you know, using such a new piece just, just for gun. The gun looks a bit awkward, and another useless Chima weapon that they just built for design, I guess. Uh, design wise, Stealth Thor is decent, very detailed again, as always, those guys are always detailed. Um, his face, it's, it's okay, it's okay, it does look like the lion face a bit, but meh. A bit different, also the gray uh, thing makes it look a bit different from uh, Fangar, or Sir Fangar, I should say. So, yeah, that's that's Stealthor for you, the stealthy guy. Look, my hand is here, ha ha ha. Here's Mr. Sir Fanger, and yes, this platform is a bit cheap. That's why if I do this, it's just gonna... But hey, at least... What? At least I can do this. I am Sir Fanger. Yeah, so as you can see... Uh, Design-wise, this guy is pretty decent. You can see there's a nice, nice, uh, nice white cape. That's that's nice. It's a new piece, I guess. Well, at least a new collar for for an old piece. And like the the trans blue arm and the trans blue leg. That is nice. Design-wise, very well done. I like that he is white. I mean, I, I'm not trying to be racist here, but I mean, I like that he's white and not gray. Definitely not, nef definitely not black. I mean, I'm, I'm not trying to be racist here. Okay, okay, so, as I said, nice level of detail. Uh, also, he has a brown tooth. He should brush his teeth from time to time. See, he used Colgate on that one. He used Crest on that one. Oh! So, weapon, weapon is decent. Looks like a sword. The only problem I have with this and is just doesn't work like a sword. Look at it. The edge is like the other way around. If you put it so that it faces um downwards, it just looks ugly. So another basically unpractical weapon. GG Chima slash Lego Company slash whatever. Game freak. Uh but I do like this uh, minifig a lot. Gotta say, the cape looks awfully good, and in comparison to Mr. Gorzan here, who is completely ugly, um, I like this one. 
Next up is this. What the heck is this? Next up is this thing, the motorbike thing, I guess. Uh, it's decent, definitely. Uh, it's a bit cheap here. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Uh, it just fell. Sure, of course it fell apart. But I, I don't know. Design wise, it's okay. There's this thing here. I don't know what its what its purpose is, uh, but whatever. I guess I guess that's a thing. Uh, this is movable a bit. I'm uh, sorry, I'm about just me 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 it is. Uh, good. So it's okay design wise, but it, it looks really cheap, and it looks like the kind of tricycle uh, some sort of kid would have. So I I, I, I guess that's it. That's nothing else to say about this thing. Finally, we have the big um, mammoth thing. No, the saber tooth thing. Sorry, I'm getting mixed up here. Uh, main function, or I, I, I guess, you can put this here. Hey, you can do this. It works, kinda. Other than that, if the bicycle is not there, or the tricycle, or whatever, the back looks very empty, and I don't like that. Look, look, look. Does this look like a finished Lego set? Absolutely not. Shh, shh. Looks ugly. Looks like there's still another uh, bag of pieces to to use. Look at this. Wow, this looks very good. This looks nice amount of detail. It's per It's perfect. Look at that. Well done. The person who designed this, very creative, very nice. Um, the head looks awesome if you put both pieces, it's like, well, it's not super balanced. <laughs> it's not balanced, absolutely not. Design-wise, it's like a mess. This is gorgeous, Th this is so perfect, this is so, yeah, you know, there's nothing, there's, I don't know what to say about it, it's just, it's that, it's there, because it's there, I don't know. There's just not much to say about it. If you put this here, looks a bit better, but I mean, there's there's still this whole thing. I'm, I'm still wondering if, if I forgot some pieces or whatever, because it, it looks ugly. This looks very good. But, as I said, there's a lack of balance. But if we're talking about balance, though, now we're going to start to be like some sort of other subject, because... This set is well balanced. If we're talking about this, you can do so much with it. Look at that! It's standing on one leg and it is not falling. This this leg is not touching the ground, by the way. But look at that. That is so amazing. It's standing on one leg. And it's not falling. You can do all sorts of things with this set. You can you can make it stand uh, this way. You know you can you can do so much with it, and it's not gonna fall. Look at that! How often can you do that with the Lego set? That is amazing. Uh, I'm so happy about this set, or at least about this part of the set, because that is just so gorgeous. Well, not gorgeous, but so practical. Stop motion wise, good game. That is awesome. That is completely awesome. You want to do some stop motion and you only have this set? Well, you're going to get a million subscribers because this set is powerful. By the way, do not take my words seriously. You will not get to a million. Well, I mean, you can, but you probably won't get to a million subscribers by having only this set. I mean, I don't even know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> Guy who has 500 subscribers on the main channel. Anyway, uh, sorry if I'm sneezing or I don't. I guess for like the past two or three re reviews, I've been sneezing. So whatever. Uh, so so yeah. Balance wise, it's it's amazing. Stop motion wise, it's amazing. But design wise, it's amazing. Uh, okay, it's, it's there's a lack of balance, but. I guess they would have had to raise the price a bit to do a little bit here, make a butt or something, because, hey, ooh, look at that, that's a tail. That is, 
That doesn't look, I mean, that looks like a tail, but come on. It's a bit awkward. If you look at it this way, it look, yeah, it look, it looks like a dinosaur. Not bad, not bad. It looks like a freaking dinosaur. I like that. I like it very much. Also, you can move the mouth a bit. You can move it really, you can open it so wide that it just looks awkward. Look at that. Awkward. And I guess that's it for this review. I don't know, think whatever you're thinking about me and my reviews, but hey, they are here for fun, I guess. So hit that like button down below for us if you enjoyed the video and are a proud member of the Mia family. Comment, it's always appreciated. Subscribe to see Mia if you haven't already. Join the Mia family, it's quite awesome over here. Also, do not forget to check out our main channel, see me extra uploads, stop motion, uh, let's plays, top 10 theories. Pokemon competitive battling, a lot of stuff. It's just an awesome channel. It has more subscribers than this one, so go and check it out if you haven't already. I'll see you next time, but as always, Zanet.